hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to High Chieftain Boltoff as the Chieftain of Lapland as we continue with his Scandinavian escapades, leading the reindeer to conquer more and more of northern Scandinavia. Uh, I want to go toward this guy in an effort to pick up... Ooh, he's actually got a duchy, has he? No, two separate counties, so... But if I subjugate him, then that's going to be the whole thing. I just don't have the prestige for it. Right. I need a little bit of prestige. So, let's have a feast first. Build up that prestige. I hope you're all doing well, though, and enjoying the series. If you are, please do consider leaving a like or subscribing to the channel to help us continue to grow. Uh, Chieftain Byton, what are you doing, man? He's drunk. He's my chancellor as well. Come on, man. Should have higher standards. And we definitely want fort first, because that could give us some more prestige. And prestige is all important in this playthrough. It would seem. Uh, we learn of Anna's non... Wait. So my high priestess is a non-believer. Well, what the bloody hell is going on there? Uh, do we now have enough to conquer or subjugate you? We would have enough to subjugate you. Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, oh, it sounded a bit Lord of the Rings-esque, that music. Let's head up towards there. Do we need to call in an ally? Probably not. I don't think we'll actually be able to, do we? Yeah, I don't have the prestige for it. But we do have the option to have a hunt, so let's do that and get some more prestige. Just on the off chance that we're going to need it. But I'm hopeful that we won't. Uh, we can bring it down, get more prestige there. That's one way to do it. Alright, he has got his ally, which brings him up to 1300. But I think we'll be okay. We've got plenty of prestige now. Uh, maybe just go take his capital. That might well end the war even, uh, even more quickly for us. And what goes with the succession? I have a lot of sons. Um, I've got you, who's okay. You're alright. No one's particularly genius material. Um, but our health is okay for the moment, so I'm not too concerned about our succession right now. Uh, I could upgrade this. It's going to get me more money. Is there anything that's going to get me more prestige? No, but we should probably pick up this war camps just because it's slightly cheaper and also does give us some benefits. We've had a grandson. Uh, what's your wife like? She's actually rather good. So maybe we do want to stick with you having her. That's fine. Um, oh God, what the hell is the succession law? Blocked for tribal government. Well, how do I get out of tribal government? Don't even know. Six months to siege here, wow. It's going to take us a little bit of time, but that's okay. Decisions. The Kingdom of Danelaw. Oh, that's cool. Can found a new kingdom. Adopt feudal ways. What do we need for this? Absolute tribal authority. 
How do I reform the faith? Bloody hell, there's a lot to go on before we can do this. How do we reform? Ah, okay. So we can actually reform it. Uh, we picked up Overseer. I think we probably want Hit and Run. We also need a new Steward. Uh, I guess my son's going to be the best bet. Unfortunately, he's all I've got. <clears throat> Meanwhile, we've got 40 days left of sieging here. And they've got a lot more troops than they did have. They seem to have picked a few up. Eric, you want to be a good marshal. Folk, you want to be a good priest. Oh, perfect. We actually just picked up the end of this war in a nice, easy fell swoop. That is perfect. Now, what's this guy good at? He is a half-decent marshal. Okay, I mean, first things first, we've just got to sway him. There's kind of no ifs or buts about it. Let's get you that. If I have any more prisoners of yours, I should probably just release them. Uh, demand religious conversion, and that's it. That's all I want you to do. Just demand religious conversion. Who do you work for? You work for him as well. That's fine. Who do you work for? You work for no one. And you're already of the faith. You are lowborn and work for no one. So we'll just release you anyway. So we've got big gain of land there. <clears throat> Not necessarily the uh, troop gain that we would have liked. A little bit worried by Sweden. Yeah, I am slightly worried there. Uh, you lot, what have you got going on? Not a lot, and we can pretty much just conquer your county for free. Which I would not be against. We need to reform our faith. Three or four vassals will convert. Your old faith will consider you astray. Oh, God. There's a lot to do. But I need an awful lot of piety before I can do that. Um, let's have her watched. Okay. So you're only getting this bit of land. Let's gain some piety because we have none. Christina comes of age and she's actually turned out rather well. Eric comes of age and he's actually turned out quite nicely as well. He is going to get this county. So that's alright. Let's get their marriages going. She has not married the best person in the world, but that's okay. She's delicate. Hmm. Um, you do not work for anyone, do you? You're kind of sat in the middle of my land. So we probably want to take you out next. And just conquer you. She's trying to convert. You're trying to do that. You're keeping folks happy. We've got more troops in Sweden and Norway, in fairness. Um, about even with Denmark. What do we need before we can become a king? We need... Two duchy titles... Hold on. 
I need... 10 of them. Okay, well, we're going to get two. You're going to war with him. That's fine. We'll help you out. Although we probably won't. Gaining opinion with that vassal would be helpful. We can next have a feast in three years. So, bit of a way yet. This is a problem. How the hell do we become an organised faith? <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. Uh, I don't particularly want to subjugate him. I just want to pick him up. Oh, nice. Thanks, son. He's giving us some good stuff. To the point where I could actually invest that here. You're already fully upgraded, so... Yeah, as the tribal holding goes... You're pretty much at the point... That you can be. Now, faith wise and <laughs> culture wise, we've got problems. It's not going to be an easy change for us. Uh, oh, I think we just go for it. I really want to get you first, but I don't know how long the truce is going to last. You're not going to accept vassalage. Unfortunately. Uh, I can get this and give it to one of my sons, I guess. We don't even need a massive army. What, 2k? I'd have thought 2k would do it. Depends what his allies have got. Actually, this is probably all of our troops, isn't it? <laughs> yep. Yeah. That's fine. Right, go up there. We've got some good commanders now. Uh, we can have a feast in two years. And I want to try and build up... Ah, that's one thing we could do. Is grab another one of you. That's a lot of prestige, though. Maybe not. That is too much prestige. I need enough to go to war with you afterwards. His troops are higher quality. What the hell has he got? He's only got archers. And we've got more. I'm not buying that. Right, let's go and try and take them out. Who's going to get there first? I'm going to say us, because we're halfway through. Boltov comes of age. What does he get? He's actually a brilliant strategist. So he's turned out quite nicely as well. Being raided. Who the hell's raiding me? Where are they? Ra oh, over there. The Finnish, of course. The Finns are raiding us. Well, I can't really do much about that. Unfortunately. When this is built, we will try and upgrade it. God, it costs so much prestige.
We just took someone prisoner. Can I ransom him for a bit of gold? I can. That's worth doing. Picked up a perk. Um, let's get that. Got 300 gold. I've got a crap ton of gold, but I just have nothing I can use it for right now. I can feast in about a year's time. Year and a half. How's my dude's health? He's 49, so he's okay. Negotiate an alliance. Who are you? Uh, sure. Another 800 troops to call on would be handy. I'd be happy with that. This siege is going to end in a couple of months. What I really need to build... Why don't I have any duchy available buildings? Because I do own the duchy. Maybe you just can't because of the type we are? I don't know. If that's the case, that sucks. Uh, oh, we just picked him up. Can I ransom you for gold? And... Then I'm going to conquer your lands. Ah, oh, I got your son as well. Again. Yeah, I haven't got enough gold for him though. I'll ransom him though. In about 12 days. So we can milk all we can for him. So 14. And that'll do. Right, and now this is picked up. Can I give it... To, in fact, don't even give it to someone. Don't spoil what's going on, because you're about to get... You're going to get that county. And you're going to get that county, which is... Where is this county? The capital. Right. So those are the two we're investing in, basically. Awesome. Um, and we've gained that. Can we go to war with you? Not yet. I'm still being raided, apparently, by some bloody raiders. So let's go and kill them get rid of their asses off my land. Also, if we catch them, that's good gold for us. I can create an another duchy entirely. And we've had a granddaughter. Excellent. Right, they've just raided me. Not happy about it. Gonna try and chase them down. Probably won't be able to catch up to them though. You're going to war with your Duke of Prussia. Good luck. Is all I can say. I mean, we're making grounds. Go there. He's gonna wanna get on a boat. So he wants to get away. Ah, we might actually be able to catch him. I wonder how much gold he's got on him. Oh, little bugger, it's you. You're the one that's raiding me. Oh, well, surely I can raid them. How much gold have you got here? 19. It's probably not even worth it for us. We don't need gold, I just need more prestige. But I can't build. It might be because we're of different culture, in fairness. That could be a reason. 
I need to up this as well. God, we need to do so much with our prestige. Right. You're definitely the next conquering. You lot... Um, what are you? You're basically all of four counties. We could invade the kingdom, but that costs me a absolute shed ton. I could subjugate you, but we're at similar strength, unfortunately. Who are your allies? Your allies are down there and down there. Hmm. Yeah, that is a little bit of a worry. War camps here are nearly built. You guys are trying to build a long house. That's going to get us more prestige. Uh, can we have a feast again? In November we can have a feast. My grandson's just been taken prisoner. So that's his war buggered. <laughs> Unfortunate for him. Sammy targets. That's not good. I need them to like me. Oh, I can pick you off now. Right. Go conquer him. Right off the bat. I mean, we've already pretty much killed his army off. Because he was an absolute... Charlatan. I gain a bit of stress, but he gets close to me. Let's do it. And I can also have my feast in a couple of months. So that's good. Eight months to siege this place. What the hell has he got here? Hopefully something good. I mean, Lapland as a whole is not doing too bad. Norway is looking decidedly weak now. Is that because they've been fighting England? Okay, England is ruled by William the Conqueror. Philip's doing alright. Alba's looking okay. Let's give some time to think. I think that's the best course of action. None of my buildings are yet done. Although, I don't think it's going to take them that long. Yeah, 22 days left. Why are you going to war again, little grandson? You absolute nutter. Hopefully this guy is going to take a long time to siege Jokmok. How long? 10 months, that's fine. Right, you've done all that you can do. It's going to cost me 300 to upgrade you, so I am going to have another feast. Uh, and as soon as I can, I will upgrade you. Welcome, friends. Hopefully we can pick up some decent perks, maybe even famous reveler. Sorry, wife, I need the prestige. Let's be frank. It's too... Too needed. She gains friendship. Um, this is my... Oh, this is my daughter. Did she marry... When did you marry the King of Estonia? Completely forgot that. Okay, well, let's have a friendship. So, are we allies? Ah, oh, he doesn't like me. That's a shame. Okay, good. We've got a lot of prestige now.
Plus I'm about to finish this war. Took a prisoner. Can I get some cash out of her? I can. And enforce that demand. Right. That deals with you. Now, what is my third son getting? He's still getting the things he was going to get, which is absolutely fine. Um, I can upgrade this, which is worth it. Can I also have a hunt now? I can also have a hunt. Jacques Mock, I can't do anything until this longhouse is constructed and it's going to take six months. Bloody hell. Protected peasant, we must cover this up. Alright, let's hope it goes well. Oh, that didn't go well. I can do this. Let's do that. Alright, at least we're a novice hunter now. That gives us a bit more prowess. And a good deal of stress release. We've got lots of buildings coming up. Uh, his health is fine. He's getting a bit older. But his health is doing alright. I just need your alliances to disband. Probably when he dies, that's when we strike. But we are at 3,600, so we're doing pretty well. She's become a thrifty clerk. And you can marry. Chieftain of Lace. That's not particularly helpful to me. None of these are particularly great. Uh, envelopment. That would be nice. I do want to get a bit more... Prestige income. Alright, there's two months left here. She's very slow to get the prestige. Okay, well that wall was always going to be a failure. So that's okay. Uh, Asil is fine. You flatter me, my lady. Abandon the scheme. I don't need any romance, thank you. Uh, you're at war with... Oh, you're actually facing a peasant revolt. Oops. So you're struggling a little bit. Good, my longhouses have been built. Still can't build anything there. I need 300 prestige to build that. Ugh. So really, it's just a case of going to war with you, which is going to be fairly expensive. What about you? Who have you got allies with? You're only a couple of thousand. So we could go across and take the Duchy of West Kilt. Which might not be a bad idea. Let's grab that duchy whilst we've got the prestige. Raise all your troops. Then take them down. Just go through their lands. I don't think they'll mind. He says. So they've got 2,000. Oh, I've got a new chief church dude. Let's give him a gift. Get him on side. I think 3,700 should be enough. I would hope. If not, we can hire some mercs. 
which actually aren't that too expensive. Ooh, you just converted faith in where? Here? You did. Nice. Please continue converting the faith. Sparring grounds? When did I build sparring grounds? Uh, military engineer would be nice. Oh yeah, I built sparring grounds ages ago. Who's been building sparring grounds? I do not remember building here, but okay. Uh, what have we got? Peasant rabble. Bit of a nuisance because I'm going to be at war. So ideally, I don't need it, but we'll see. Definitely, definitely need some more prestige though. Basically need to build longhouses everywhere. Are these guys hostile? There is a lot happening right now. Are you at war with... Okay, you're at war with a lot of people. Um, if I can take that, that might go a long way for us. He has got three counties. That is the only thing I am concerned about. You're just going to make it, I think? Yes, good. Hopefully you pick up a prisoner. Hmm. Five months to siege. Maybe go kill his army. It's probably better for the war score. Just go there. He's a cracking general, but not quite as good as ours. All right, we got his steward. Hopefully, one more siege ought to do it. I'm concerned about this peasant rabble as well. Uh, you, what happens if we execute you? I gain some dread, I gain some faith. Sacrifice him. Who else have I got as a prisoner? Get me some piety. Sacrifice her. Human sacrifices <clears throat> are needed. I need to become pious. What's her faith? Uh, she is not of my faith. All friends and lovers. She's got nobody of significance. That'll probably do. That's got that's got us a decent amount of faith, to be fair. All right, I've got two months left of my siege. Hopefully, that's going to get us enough to win this war. I'm reluctant to keep it going. Okay, peasant rabble, how much are you going to have? 1200. I need 21 days. And where are you? You're there. So that's not too bad. You're there and there.
Right. Good day to you. Uh, I need to deal with a peasant rabble before I do anything else. So, I think what we'll do is disband the troops. As soon as they've moved. Summon them up north. Or as far as we can get them. To go and kill them. Uh, we must be nearing the point of becoming king. Two more counties and we should be there. Awesome. At the same time, these guys are trying to conquer us, so it needs to be slightly wary of that. I might not continue to sway our head of faith. Let's put it towards you instead. Um, okay, and it reckons we will win this. Ten months left there. That should be absolutely fine. Is my son still getting... Yeah, he's even getting West Kilt as well. That's good. I can gain a bunch of prestige. Which is actually really needed right now. A feast at the end of next year. A new perk. That's helpful. Uh, your sieging here is going to take you six months. Well, we might struggle, but hopefully we'll make it. Quickly get rid of them. And now you need to go and kill this lot. What's this going to cost you? Oh, it's only four. That's okay. Can I execute you, my friend? I can. That gives me some more piety. Uh, who are you? You're a bit of a nobody as well, so let's get you executed. Uh, and you are Norwegian. Let's get you executed. Okay, I'm owning a lot of land right now, which is probably... Not so good for us, but... Right. Go and take him out. Meanwhile, what do you need to upgrade? Nothing. What do you need to upgrade? Probably just war camps here. And you're having a bunch of kids. Excellent. So he's going to have three counties. So he'll be just fine. You get two. You get three. And you get two. That's okay. I'm only investing in the two that my main son is going to get. Just in the interests of him. Basically being as strong as possible. I don't want him to get challenged. Ideally. And we've got eight months left. So we should be a-okay. If all goes well. Six months. You can marry. You can get me an alliance with this dude. That would be helpful. 
another 900 troops to add to us. Am I at war with them? Oh, they're allies. Does this mean your alliance has broken down? Not quite. And you're still alive. Bloody hell. But we are two counties away from being able to form my kingdom. Three months left to siege. Losing a little bit of gold. I have virtually no prestige, but we are actually gaining some piety for once. She's at chivalry. Um, can we have a feast at the end of the year? Yes. We should earn a decent bit of gold from this as well. Let's pick this up for a nice, pretty penny. Any chance of a, a ransom? Right, we'll, we'll just execute her then for the faith. And um, we got 60 gold. Only 10 prestige. But that's something. We can go and conquer you straight away, although I don't even have the prestige to conquer you, which is pretty bad. My troop count is absolutely abysmal. Don't know what's going on there. I've got low control everywhere right now. It is not looking good. Why are we at so low troop count? Levies seem to have just been shot to pieces. Can I start giving out their lands? Um, like now, if they're of age. Okay, so you're of age, you're expecting... Um, you're getting this place. So can I give you this place? Right, grant lands. You're due to get this. You're also due to get this. And you're due to get East Kilt. Go and have it, because I need to get rid of some places. And it will reduce my penalty, which I think is what's causing us problems. Right, and what does that do to you? Absolutely nothing. So that's fine. Okay, that seems to have sorted us out. We'll also have an alliance. You're building there. You're also building there for me. And it's now really just a question of prestige. We can have a feast in December, which we will do so. I can pick up this, but I think we'll have to do that next episode. Um, third in line for an absolute bunch of titles. But Lapland is continuing to grow. Sweden's doing quite well. Norway is once again taken by Denmark, so that's interesting. Let's see what happens there. Yeah, I have a duty of care to the subjects. <clears throat> uh, we could go on a pilgrimage. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go on a pilgrimage to Sigtuna. Try and get a little bit of faith. Uh, you are not the best. So let's pop you in on that roll. Uh, I might gain some stress here. I can gain dread but lose piety. 
or accepting of people with different cultures. I don't want to do that. We're not going to be accepting. Right, so you are an insightful thinker. You've turned out quite poorly. If I could disinherit you, I would, but I can't even afford anything like that. Um, because your faith has the ancestor worship tenant, I gained in the footsteps of my forebears. Okay, that's quite cool. If I have a prisoner... Oh, I don't have any prisoners. Can I have a feast yet? I can have a feast when we're back home. But we're not back home yet. Now we're home. Let's have a feast. Uh, you've pretty much built all that you can build. You're building what you can. Folk can marry. Let's just get him someone with good skills. Crusades are now live. But are any of you Catholic? Oh, you're all Catholic. We are the only Norse faith. Well, that could be a problem. <laughs> it's tiny. Yeah, that's quite a big problem. We'll have to see how that goes. But for now, Lapland is doing fairly well. We continue to build. Uh, we need to try and get this central area sorted so that we can get the last two claims. But once this guy dies, I think we'll be clear to press on and attack to gain the actual duchy. Probably want the other duchy, but that's okay. What's the other duchy? That's two counties, isn't it? Yeah, that's fine. And that's one county, so I need this one. That's 169 prestige. More than enough. And with that, we will be able to form our kingdom. But for now, ladies and gentlemen, we will end the episode there. Thank you all ever so much for watching. Please do like, subscribe, comment, all those good things. And I'll see you all next time. Hello! <laughs>